Hey guys, it's me, Tina Marie, with True Meaning of Radiance. Today's video is actually going to be a candle review. You guys wanted a review on this candle, and I figured why not bring you a review on this candle uh, in my pretty pumpkin holder. Yep, I have my pretty <laughs> of pumpkin holder. This is from Bath & Body Works. It runs for $26.50, I believe. It is super duper cute. And right now they're actually doing 10 off 30 on the website. So if you go on the website, you order it now, you'll get um, $10 off. It just adds something else for $4 in your cart. And you will have the 10 off 30 because I have not seen these in stores. Some stores have them, but none of my stores got it. So I had to order all order it online of course the first one came broken but never fear they sent a second one and the second one is not broken and in the second one i have cider lane um so i will be reviewing cider lane one wick reviewing gooey caramel now gooey caramel um is drizzle caramel crystallized sugar and butter melted butter and as you can see it does burn evenly I have no problem with the burn at all. It is a soy blend uh, wax candle. We all know that. Um, one thing I can say I hated about this candle is the wicks. The wicks are very, very, very thin. The first time it did drown out one of the wicks, this wick actually got drowned out. And I had to, you know, get up some of that extra wax. That way um, it will continue to burn evenly. So that kind of sucked. Um, the overall performance, I do keep this in the open concept room. Um, and it's about a five. Like, I can't lie to you guys. I can't give this candle a 10. It's not a 10. It's about a five. I and mean, when you're coming in from downstairs, you can smell it. And you get, ooh, a nice little caramel, warm, like, ooh, warm caramel, like, just feel of... I don't know, like warmth to your heart kind of thing. But then, you know, you move on to the next room, you can't smell it. My bedroom is close to the open concept of the living room and the kitchen. And in my bedroom, I cannot smell this candle whatsoever. Um, and then when I get to the back part of the living room, which is the den where the kids have their gaming area, I cannot smell this candle at all. So that's why I give it a throw out of five out of 10 because to me, the throw is just not as good as it should be. Um, let's get to packaging. This packaging to me makes no sense. Um, I love, you know, nice packaging, you know, but gooey caramel and this marbleized <laughs> packaging makes no sense. I don't know what White Barn was thinking, but the packaging is so ugly. Like you see how this cute pumpkin holder, this would have been nice with some wax the same color as the pumpkin peanut brittle and then had some nice design on the front of gooey caramel just gushing out and it would have looked so cute so this packaging is just whack i'm sorry white barn bath and body works what are y'all doing this packaging is ugly and i don't like that it's a white wax i am not a fan of white wax for some reason i just do not like white wax I don't know what it is I just don't like it but all in all it is a decent candle I would never pay retail price for it it's $24.50 I would never um I did get this on sale so I got it I think these candles were $14.50 at the time or something like that and they're always running candle deals like don't ever pay full price for a candle I mean you can go on Macari right now and I've seen some of these on Macari for $19 when their website is offering it for $24.50 right now. So that makes zero sense. But whatever Bath & Body Works you want to do, do it makes you feel good. But anyway, so that's my review on Gooey Caramel. Um, it's okay. Packaging is very, very ugly. Um, I don't like the packaging at all. It doesn't put me in the mindset of any gooey caramel at all. I think they should redo the packaging as far as, you know the setting and everything i've had no problems i did have to make sure i took care of my wicks because they were so thin that one blew out because it was too much wax but that's about it and it gives a decent throw um so it's nice to put into an open concept room i wouldn't put gooey caramel in a bedroom or something like that because to me it's just not a bedroom scent i don't know that's just my opinion y'all let me know yours in the comment below but i don't think i want my 
bedroom, my master bedroom smelling like gooey caramel when uh that ain't what's supposed to be going on in the bedroom. I guess I guess if you want to take some caramel in the bedroom, you can, but uh that's a whole nother subject, not whole nother video. But gooey caramel to me is just okay. It's not something that I want to back up of. I will not be purchasing a second one because I don't see a need of needing another gooey caramel. So I just decided to go ahead and review Cider Lane, make this one video. So Cider Lane, the notes in Cider Lane are warm caramel, Granny Smith apple, ground clove. Um, it says it's a soy wax blend candle and the one wicks are seven ounces. So I do, I did get some, I do, I did get some questions on the Cider Lane and one wicks in general. The one wicks do tunnel. If you guys can see, it's doing that tunnel effect. None of that wax right there is getting used up. And you can put it in a hurricane if you want. I do not put mine in a hurricane. I normally don't burn my one wicks out anyway in my living space area. I normally burn them in the bathroom. But Cider Lane is just not a scent I want to smell in my bathroom. For some reason, I think that mixed with people going to the restroom and stuff that ain't gonna mix well so no nah, i burned it right here and i'm glad i did because it has a really good throw for a one wick i give it about a throw of about a six six to a seven because it does you know give some throw to my kitchen and my living space area now is it throughout the whole house no but for a one wick it does a darn good job um i didn't want to get the big cider lane because you would have to order it online and i ain't about ordering the cider lane online especially because i didn't know much about it and even though i've used it and i do have a second one a backup i still would not order this candle online a full size it is a nice candle great scent is everything everyone's saying and more but it's not really my cup of tea um, it's good and it's going to be really good in the fall, especially on one of them cozy nights and you just light cider lane. It's going to be good. Don't get me wrong. It's just not my go to. I'm more into the gourmands a lot. So it's a really nice um, scent, especially if you like uh, clove. I'm not a big clove person. I guess the that part of it is what turns me off the ground clove, but that's okay because cider lane is always a favorite for everyone so cider lane is a really good candle i have nothing bad to say about it so don't come here looking for negativity it's a decent candle decent throw the one wicks they do tunnel which suck but you can always put this on a warmer and burn it down or you can put it in a hurricane and that should help so yeah i hope you guys rate comment subscribe definitely check out bathandbodyworks.com if you like these uh pumpkin holders because they're super cute um and if you do shop bath and body works and you're doing it online y'all know go through rakuten that way y'all can get some cash back or if you're going to go in stores go through ibotta that way you can get cash back in stores i love you guys thanks for checking out the review if you want me to keep doing reviews on candles definitely let me know in the comments below remember rate comment subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one bye guys end of the video but i wanted to come back on here real quick to say if you haven't caught my last video definitely go and catch up on the other videos it actually was a elf and color pop haul um so if you're into makeup definitely make sure to check out that video i am trying to branch out and do different things guys so definitely be there with me help me branch out and we're almost to 33,000 subscribers please definitely share this video with a friend make sure you share it on your social media just help branch out the channel i definitely love bringing videos to you guys and i definitely want to keep the subscriber rate growing um because we're on the road to 100k and we're going to get there one day at a time so thank you guys for tuning in thank you guys for enjoying make sure to catch up on the videos you have missed and if your gray notification bell is not on turn that bad boy on because i heard some people saying that the bell went off so make sure you turn that bell on that way when i upload you're always in the know and i love you guys thanks for checking it out